What's going on guys, Cernex here, and today I'm going to show you an updated way to install the Tmod Loader for Terraria 1.3.5.4. So you're going to go to the link in the description uh, to the Tmod Loader download. There's Windows, Macs, and Linux versions. Click whatever version you're on, uh, which I'm on Linux. Save it. Go to where you have downloaded the Tmod Loader files, which mine are in YouTube videos, but it doesn't really matter. Right click and extract files. Click OK. Uh, just ignore this right here. It's just because I already have it on my thing because I updated it recently. Open your uh, Tmod Loader folder that you've just extracted. I'm going to make it big screen here so you can see. Copy these. And then you want to go to Computer, your disk drive, whichever one hard drive you have Steam on. Let me make this full screen again. And then you go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Terraria. Now you just want to right click and paste them in there and select yes to all. Uh, except for the Terraria.exe, you want to keep that. So that's it. Now you have Team Mod Loader installed. Now I'll show you how to install a few mods such as the Alchemist and PC. So once you're into your game, you just want to launch up the new version of the game, the new .exe Terraria. Go to Mod Browser. Let it load up here. Then you can look up any mod that you want. Uh, right now I'm just going to make a tutorial for the Alchemist NPC mod. Just as a little thing. Since I already have installed, I uh, had to show all mods. But then you just want to click download. Uh, which there should be a download thing there. It's just because I already have installed. It's not there. Then it'll download it for you. Back out. Go to mods. You can look up the mod. Uh, or just if it's your first time installing, you should have a, just one mod. Uh, so just look it up real quick. Mine's already enabled. So I'm going to disable it real quick. Just so I can enable for you guys to show you what it does. So now you can enable it. You want to click Reload Mods so it loads it into your Terraria game. As you can see, it's reloading all the mods I have enabled, which is this is for my RPG playthrough. And now you should have it once it adds the recipes and stuff, and that's it. It's quick, simple, and easy. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.